When, on the 24th of June, we either woke up or we'd been up all night to discover that the country had been literally split in two. The Remain side only got 48% and the Leave side got 52%, way for thin. This was almost half and half. It's the duty of all patriots to speak up when you can see danger ahead for your country. And for all of us who can see danger for Britain as a result of Brexit, have a duty to speak up. vote. The people's vote happened in 2016 and the people voted to leave. And the people voted to leave. Stop! Brexit! Remain should have won the referendum in 2016. Of course, we should have won. And in my view, we would have won with an entirely different campaign. I'm saying the future of this country depends on following what 17.4 million people said, and that is leaving the European Union. The mandate we have is 17.4 million people. There are no longer 17.4 million Leave supporters. That number is outdated. Maybe one day, Britain will want to rejoin the EU for the same reasons we joined in the first place. Peace, prosperity, security, and a say in Europe. I want a world in which uh, we send you Marmite, you send us Vegemite.
It was offshore wind that puffed the sails of Drake and Raleigh and Nelson and propelled this country to commercial greatness. And this deal is ready to go. You just whack it in the microwave. The tragedy is that many people in Britain do not understand the origins of the European community. We are looking back on over 70 years of peace, which our continent has never known before.